me redneck, white trash, and blue collar. But I could change all that if I had a couple million dollars. What is going on, everybody? It's your boy Matt back with another video. Um, the sun's back out. I know, right? The sun is back out, and today is Sunday for me. It's gonna be Thursday for you if you're watching it on the day it's uploaded. Um, um, the un well, first off, let me tell you where we're going. Um, we are going to Waterburger, get some dinner for me and my brother. Um, and so that way he's got a full stomach before he goes to his Sunday class. And then, um, I don't know why everybody's looking at me kind of weird. Um, the unbelievable, unthinkable happened at my house. Okay, so let me give you a little background story. So yesterday, which uh, for me would have been Saturday, Saturday the 24th. Went to my grandmother's house. I drove. Um, we were uh, going over there to do some paperwork, get that done for them. And um, so we got there. My grand, my mom went with my grandmother to the tax office or the bank or whatever, do some stuff. And I come back. And they called me on the phone, or they, because they were, they picked up food and they called me on the phone. And they said, "Hey, I need some help. We're, we're gonna need some help outside." I'm thinking what, to myself, "Why? What, what? There's two of y'all, and you only ordered three meals, and it, they put them all in one bag. So it, it didn't make sense to me. But the minute I opened up the door, my grandmother's holding something. I said, "What? What is she holding? The thing's moving." Okay, now I'm concerned. What is she holding that's moving? She's holding a dog. They picked up a dog on the side of the road. Um, looks like a pup. A little Boston Terrier. Um, I did use the metal detector for chips. Nothing. Nothing came up. I felt around for a chip see if somebody maybe owned it but to me it just looked like it was just a normal street dog um yeah so that was interesting and so we're giving it a bath and all this and everything we're cleaning it up making it look all nice and my brother does something I never thought he would ask can we keep it? Really? Can we keep it? I mean, seriously. So, needless to say, I've got a dog at the house now. And the cats absolutely hate the dog. Right now. So, yeah. That's my little drama story. God, what have I, what have my mom and I gotten ourselves into? It's a Boston Terrier. Them things are little lap dogs. I mean, seriously, lap dogs. Lap dogs. Cause they don't do much. I'm thinking, oh, well, maybe they got a German Shepherd that ran away from somebody or something. We'll go return him and be that and then go home. Nope. Got a freaking dog at the house now. I'm not pissed about it, but I'm not super excited about it. Because when my brother got Zoe, or when we got Zoe, our newest kitty, who was only a year and a half old, supposed to be my brother's cat. She's my cat now. Bonded to me. Follows me everywhere like a lost puppy. Yeah, so that's fun. Um, yeah, 
and those chores became mine. So, yeah, I am not a happy camper. Because I know eventually I'm going to have to start taking care of that dog. Yeah. So. Yeah, I'm not quite happy about all of this, but what can you do? Shit's happened already. Shit's already hit the fan. So. What can you do? Alright, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, subscribe, and all that good stuff, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.